Global Cinema Festival 2020. Hello, Nigel. What is this film about? Why is the story called A Rose Between Thorns? It's basically, basically it's about a, a girl by the name of Rose who tries to find an escape from her abusive family by, by, by the means of dance. Yeah, and her troubles just follow her while she dances. Why did you choose this subject matter and this topic for your film? Um, child abuse is a very touchy subject and the one really want to speak about it, you know. So we use this medium to highlight that issue. It's best to showcase it, let, let people be aware of it and start, uh, start to stand up for it because we can't keep on letting it be swept under the rug, you know. Uh, these kids are going to feel like, oh, they're going to they're gonna continue doing it. Which is, it's just sickening, honestly. Tell us more about the work and the style of the film and how you take the film uh, towards a love story between Rose and Tony. The, the work and style, we start with that first. Uh, we use a lot of symbols in the film. Uh, we, uh, we showcase, well, it's basically about Rose spirit animals, Rose spirit animal wanting to be free. So you see in the beginning of the film and in the film, we're in on an empty beach. So that's basically Rose wanting to be free. As we progress with the storyline now, um, Antonio, which is the next main character in the film, is like Rose wants to be with him, but she's afraid because of what, what's happening in her personal life. The film was about Rose, Rose's um, family life. Yeah. They offer help, but she turns everyone away. In the ending now, she basically stands up for herself. Tell us a little bit about your working experience with the cast and crew. Well, uh, um, well, Sing does have a film industry. So we came together. Uh, I'm, I'm well respected. I'm well respected because I do videos. I do videos. I do a lot of carpet work and music videos. So I'm kind of respected in that area. I came together. I pulled together. Uh, most of them were my friends, persons I work with. I told him, let's shoot a movie, let's shoot this film. And like everybody who came to, who went to in Sato, um, they were like, I'm bored from the get-go. Uh, Rose, when I spoke to her about it, she was on board. When um, I spoke to the, the, the actor for Antonio, played Antonio, he was on board right away. Uh, Jama, he's my, one of my best friends. <laughs> so he was on board. It's the first time for, a lot of, for all of us to shoot right. a movie. You know, we, we're here to train to like, show yes. the government that film is a right. viable industry and if we come together we can make film and have it yeah. shown up across the world as right. a the fans because we, it's the first film of this kind from Sinkins to be shown, right. shown across um, several film festivals. Very beautiful movie, very bold movie, very courageous movie and it has highlighted a very, very important and relevant topic, domestic violence. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to have you joining us at the Hague Global Cinema Festival 2020.